Hey guys, what's up? So I've only done this video once ever in my channel and it was like talking about a concert that I went to and that last video was Dustin Lynch, which was like my first like country show to go to, which was like a cool experience. But in this video, I kind of want to talk about uh, going to Logic's uh, Everybody Tour, which last Tuesday we went to go see Logic here in Phoenix and I generally did not know what to expect when we got there. There was lines, I was tweeting somebody to see how big the lines were getting because we were driving like three hours from here to there. And we were like, oh God, we're not gonna get good seats at all. So we got there, we met some really cool people. One person was from New York visiting and he got lucky. The other two were from Tucson. The people in front of us were from uh, Flagstaff, which was cool that they came down. It was cool seeing everybody rocking like the Logic Everybody shirt like that he sold before he even went on tour and like the robot guy and seeing like Under Pressure and all this other stuff. But yeah, we stood there for a good, what I wanna say six hours five hours just waiting in the sun but yeah we were waiting there like 100 degree weather luckily clouds started showing up so it got a little bit easier to handle the heat we brought like 20 water bottles just for us we finished all of them surprisingly we thought we were gonna hand them out when the concert was about to start but no we finished all of those bottled water but yeah let's go into the venue so we got in and everything after like the five hours of waiting legitimately i was not expecting to get in the pit seats when we got there but yeah i did not know the two opening acts very well joey badass was pretty cool my uh, my nephew was like yeah he's a pretty cool performer so that little what 30 minutes 40 minutes that they got was pretty cool i'm gonna listen to some of his stuff see if i like it or not but yeah that crowd loved joey badass they were just screaming anytime he would leave stage they were like joey 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 he would just come back and he was like in like surprise like he was like okay you guys came for logic but you guys are actually cheering for me a lot more than other states he even mentioned that too so i was like oh wow that's cool so he's pretty big so yeah logic showed up he played his first song which was hallelujah i'm not going to spoil the set list that he does because there's some surprises in there so he is one energetic performer i was not expecting him to be that hype i looked some like live shows i was like all right cool i know what to expect but this was my uh, nephew's first concert and he was ecstatic for this he was singing every word on the ride down there he was preparing he was rapping everything because i told him like at the end of the show he kind of picks an, uh, somebody from the audience to go up there and he was like all right cool i'm gonna learn this stuff so he was doing that on the way down there this is something i haven't seen in a while for that many artists he would stop singing let everybody take a break he would explain what the song meant what this song why he created the song like 1-800 which was a suicide song which that whole crowd was just crying when he was playing it it was it was honestly an emotional song that he would play he would come back sing the first beginning just because everybody knew how much that song meant to them and he would honestly give like pep talks to everybody saying like if your friends don't believe in what you do they don't deserve to be around you when you actually get the success that you want and just giving you motivation and stuff that you want to do with your life or stuff that you're going through he says like he's been there you'll get through it and all this other stuff and you just saw people in the audience like crying but yeah he would continue playing his stuff he would play he would mostly be playing stuff from his new album but he would go back to under pressure and incredible true story yeah but it's honestly something different seeing an artist stop let their band members rest for a little bit and him talking about like just positivity of he how he is of love of just accepting yourself and all this other stuff because that was like the first crowd i've ever seen like uh gay by and all that other stuff just there and everybody got along nobody was like no no i'm not cool with you and all this other stuff everybody was just like all right cool we're gonna party we're gonna enjoy logic's concert everybody was so on a good term when that concert started everybody was like all right cool looking out for each other he even mentions it in the beginning he's like whoever's on your left and on your right if you don't know them they're your family tonight make sure you take care of them because it was hot it was almost like 100 degrees when we got into the stadium and it was an outside venue and yeah it was crazy especially coming from like 75 degrees up here going down there to 100 was not fun this show definitely is on my number one favorite concert i've been to it knocked down dustin lynch for me by hands down just because it inspired me in a couple different ways just because but yeah the concert pretty much just gave me like a whole new experience that i did not expect to get at that concert so i'm pretty much just hyped to be creating some new stuff now because of logic because he gave me some cool ideas to do for some videos at that show with his on stage performances and all that stuff so i'm probably going to do a little like tr music video thing on my instagram for one of his songs i just need to get some friends for that and i hope you guys do go see logic if you guys don't know who he is i would highly recommend you guys to go look him up but other than that he is an awesome performer a nerd at heart and they gave him money as a nerd and he's taking that advantage on stage with a little robot so I hope you guys do enjoy this and I will see you guys next week with another video and go watch Logic on the tour. It was fun. Okay, goodbye. To hope, hopefully deep down that it would touch and reach people that may have needed it. So it means
you so much to see that you guys, man, you guys are supporting this and spreading this message. It's beyond me, it's beyond you, it's for everybody, you know what I mean? So many times, we second guess ourselves, we doubt ourselves, and we've all had those thoughts in one way or another. And I think about this moment where I am right now, here, blessed, married, great friends, an incredible career, and the best fans in the world. And if I had just given up, I would have never seen this day. And in my darkest of times, I could have never imagined that it would have gotten this bright. So I truly, I beg and implore you all to stay positive, man. Keep fighting no matter what, because I want you to stay alive, I want you to be happy, and I want you to live to your fullest potential. It is greater than you can even imagine at this point. You are amazing, you are incredible, you are special. Now let me hear you say, I want to be alive. Say, I want to be alive. Now say, I'm gonna be alive.